Hi, this is a video on subtracting two sine numbers. Throughout this video, when I say magnitude, I mean the absolute value. I would highly recommend that you watch the video on absolute values in order to understand the absolute value of a number. Suppose I subtract a positive number and a negative number. The result could either be positive or negative or zero. So the usual way to approach this problem is to rewrite it in a different way. We know minus times plus is the same as plus times minus. So plus minus times plus, which is the positive number, plus a negative number. This is nothing but the addition of two numbers with different signs, which we covered in the pr previous video, or the video on adding two signed numbers. The result is always the sign of the larger number in magnitude times the larger number in magnitude minus smaller number in magnitude. For example, suppose I'd like to do 10 minus 20, which is the same as 10 plus negative 20. So the sign of the larger number in magnitude would be minus the larger number in magnitude is 20, minus the smaller number in magnitude is 10. The answer is negative 10. That is our first case. Suppose we'd like to add a positive number to a negative number. Excuse me, we subtract a positive number and a negative number. This is the same as saying plus minus times minus is actually plus. It is equivalent to adding two positive numbers. For example, you're adding plus 5 and subtracting minus 10. This is the same as saying plus 5 plus 10 because minus of minus is plus. 5 plus 10 is 15. However, it is not so easy when we do it the other way. That is, a minus times a positive number. Excuse me, the sign here has to be a negative sign because we're doing subtraction. So, when we do uh, minus, minus, plus, it is equivalent to saying minus plus a negative number. You can swap the signs. So that is the same as the sum of two negative numbers, which we know is always negative, and we add the magnitude of two numbers. For example, suppose I'd like to subtract minus 10 and my plus 30. This is the same as saying minus 10 plus minus 30, which is the sum of two negative numbers. The sign is always negative, and I sum the magnitudes of the two numbers, which is 10 plus 30. So the answer 
is minus 40. Suppose we have to subtract two negative numbers. This is the same as say, adding a positive number and a negative number because minus of minus is negative, uh, positive. And we have already done this in the first case. So the first case and the last case are one and the same, just written in different ways. For example, suppose we'd like to do minus 5 minus of minus 15. That is the same as saying minus 5 plus plus 15. Minus times minus is plus. Now, we already know this is equal to the sign of the bigger number in magnitude. The bigger number in magnitude is 15. Its sign is plus. Then the difference of the two numbers. The bigger number in magnitude is 15 minus the smaller number in magnitude, which is 5. 15 minus 5 is 10. Therefore, the answer is 10. That is how you subtract two signed numbers. Thank you for watching this video.